there are many things you can do with Safari. In this video, we are gonna show you 8 coolest Safari tricks for Mac users. These following tricks are quite different to increase your productivity and workflow within moments. So without further ado, let's get started. Pinning tab in Safari is one of my all-time favorite feature. Just drag a tab to the left to pin a tab and to the right to unpin the tab. Trust me, this is so useful. And yes, you can also right click on a tab to create a pin tab, then again right click to unpin. That moment when you accidentally close an important tab while browsing and you feel empty. No problem this time, because we have your back. To reopen all previously closed tab, just press and hold command plus shift plus T. And there you have it. Cool, right? Click the reader mode button that's at the left edge of the URL bar after loading an article to enable reader view. All the web pages formatting, ads and distractions vanish in favor of a minimal, beautiful, easy to read layout. I am the kind of person who likes to see a link to the page before opening it. Seeing the URL of a link in the status bar while hovering over it was really useful. Safari being its simple self, disabled this feature by default a while back. Thankfully if you click on view from the menu bar and select show status bar, you will get the feature back. As a news junkie, I like visiting blogs a lot. What I don't like to let is how every single one of this news site wants me to subscribe to new posts by enabling push notifications. Let's just disable this feature altogether. From the settings page in Safari, click on notifications on the bottom and check the option that says allow websites to ask the permission to send push notifications. Picture in picture is one of the best new things in Safari. Being able to watch a YouTube video that's floating over everything else is really useful. While watching YouTube, you need to right click twice on the video to reveal the contextual menu. From here, click on enter picture in picture. The video will pop right out. You can then drag it on any corner of the screen and of course resize it the way you want. Cool, right? Safari exporting a web page as a PDF doesn't require a spatial extension. Visit the page and from the file menu select export as PDF. Choose where you want to save the page and hit save to export. It's no secret that we open a lot of tabs when browsing. Safari helps manage this tab overload by neatly stacking related tabs in the tab switcher page. When you are on this page, press the command plus F shortcut and you will be able to quickly search between all your tabs. 